subscribe now and press the bell icon never miss an update hello guys this is an kitchen welcome to my mathematics class let's see the today's topic today's topic is exponential series expansion of e raised to power x today we'll find out the expansion of e raised to power x this topic i have taken from class 12 is very important for the students who are studying currently at, in class 12 uh, before finding the e expansion of e raised to power x uh, is mandatory to know the value of e or let me tell you the e, e is your irrational number whose value lies between 2 and 3 all right and uh, e is an irrational value right uh, e is defined as like this way e is equal to limit uh, of 1 plus 1 upon n uh, raised to power n as n tends to infinity using this we can find out the value of a e all right and plus we need the binomial theorem for any index okay right here 1 plus x what is the binomial theorem for any index 1 plus x raised to power n is equal to 1 plus nx plus n and minus 1 over to factorial x square plus uh, n and minus 1 into n minus 2 over 3 factorial into x3 plus dot dot to infinity provided that mod of x less than 1 okay we need here x less than 1 all right otherwise okay if x is greater than 1 this theorem will not work this theorem will not provide you the accurate value right okay so let's move uh, into the expansion of e raised to power x how to find out uh, see so proof oh i'm starting with okay. e raised to power x is equal to e raised to power x is equal to uh, okay uh, so firstly let me write down just okay e is equal to we know uh, we know e is equal to limit of 1 plus 1 upon n this is a n okay raised to power n as n tends to infinity okay uh, okay if e is this one therefore e raised to power x is equal to okay i'm going write down like this a uh, limit as n tends to infinity 1 plus 1 upon n or uh, raised to power n whole raised to power x and we can write on like this way a uh, limit as n tends to infinity of uh, 1 plus 1 upon n raised to power nx okay so here no problem uh, because due to the limit theorem we can write on like this way is equal to limit or uh, as n tends to infinity now let's find out Let's expand okay using this or uh, theorem binomial theorem for an index or you can say the binomial series using this binomial series we can find out okay because see how can we use this one because n is greater than one so one upon n is less than one so that's why we can use this theorem right okay. so using okay this binomial theorem uh, or a binomial series will get a uh, 1 plus n and your power here is an x okay times uh, x means 1 upon n or uh, instead of x we have 1 upon n and instead of n we have an x so using this we can write on this and plus next one is n x or uh, into n x minus 1 over to factorial 1 upon n whole is square right and x okay this is a x n n okay and so don't get confused or uh, and the plus uh, next one is n x right or uh, into n x minus 1 Uh, n x minus two over three factorial and into one upon n whole cube and dot dot dot. Okay, to infinity. 
Alright, so no problem. Uh, is equal to no very simple. As n tends to infinity, 1 plus and cancel x you are getting plus okay and here n here n common it will be your n square x and here x minus 1 upon n over 2 factorial or uh, into 1 upon n square plus n from your common n from your n 1 n is already there if you take n common from here, then n square, 1 n, okay, if you take from your common, then it becomes n cube. Here you will get x, and here x minus 1 upon n, and x minus 2 over n, whole, up, whole upon 3 factorial, into 1 over n cube, plus dot dot. Okay, so easy. And now n square, n square, they can be cancelled. Here yeah, n cube, n cube also can be cancelled. Okay, let's see. Now we can, right? Uh, now we can use the limit, limit, okay, we can. Now 1 plus x, as n tends to infinity, 1 upon n tends to 0. Okay, x plus here, or uh, x, x minus 0 because n tends to infinity 1 upon n tends to 0 over 2 factorial plus here x and x minus 0 x minus 0 over 3 factorial okay and uh, plus dot dot okay uh, here you understood I think okay right so as n tends to infinity 1 upon n tends to 0 as n tends to infinity, 1 upon n tends to 0, 2 upon n also tends to 0, okay? So let's see what you will get, 1 plus here x upon 1 factorial, we can write down, because 1 factorial is also 1, uh, it will be easy to start 1 factorial, 2 factorial like this, and x square upon 2 factorial plus x cube upon 3 factorial and so on to infinity, right? Okay, or... E raised to power x is equal to 1 plus x upon 1 factorial, x square upon 2 factorial, plus x cube upon 3 factorial, plus dot dot. Okay, uh, this is the, this is your expansion of e raised to power x. Now we can write down here, okay, what is the e raised to power x? x, okay, 1 plus x over 1 factorial, plus x square upon 2 factorial, plus x cube upon 3 factorial plus dot dot so on right this is the expansion of e raised to power x right so very simply we got the expansion of e raised to power x so only two things you have to know one thing okay definition of e and second thing binomial theorem for any index or you can say the binomial series if you know these two you can find out very easily the expansion of e raised to power x all right so let's find out okay some more results on uh, expansion of e raised to power x okay let's see uh, so I think you understood how to find out no problem I'm going to erase this uh, now see here uh, now we have no, we have e raised to power x is equal to 1 plus x upon 1 factorial x square upon 2 factorial plus x cube upon 3 factorial plus dot dot to infinity right now putting okay or putting x is equal to 1 all right x is equal to 1 we get what you will get okay e raised to power minus 1 one result is this one okay uh, and uh, you have to memorize uh, and then e, if we put okay, e raised to power a, x instead of x if you putting x is equal to 1 here you will get e raised to power 1 is equal to 1 plus 1 upon 1 factorial plus 1 square upon 2 of pictorial plus and uh, here okay 1 cube upon 3 factorial plus dot dot 
and or you will get e is equal to 1 plus 1 upon 1 factorial plus 1 upon 2 factorial plus and 1 over 3 factorial plus dot dot right and uh, this result also you have to memorize right so now we can say okay how e is defined in terms of factorial now we can say e is equal to the value of e we can find out 1 plus adding these all numbers 1 plus 1 upon 1 factorial plus 1 upon 2 factorial plus 1 upon 3 factorial and so on to infinity this will be the value of e which is an irrational number okay again i'm reminding you e putting again putting x is equal to minus 1 we get what we will get here uh, e raised to the power minus 6 uh, sorry minus 1 uh, is equal to 1 plus minus 1 instead of x i am using minus 1 1 factorial plus minus 1 square over 2 factorial and plus minus 1 cube over 3 factorial plus and minus 1 raised to the 4 4 factorial and so on you can move on right or you will get to okay, e raised to the minus 1 is equal to minus 1 upon 1 factorial plus 1 upon 2 factorial minus 1 upon 3 factorial minus 1 upon or oh, sorry here plus 1 factorial minus dot dot okay uh, this will be the value of e raised to power minus 1 this is the value of e, e is equal to 1 plus 1 upon 1 factorial plus 1 upon 2 factorial plus 1 upon 3 factorial and plus so on and here e raised to power minus 1 is equal to 1 plus 1 up minus 1 upon 1 factorial plus 1 upon 2 factorial minus 1 upon 3 factorial plus 1 upon 4 factorial plus so minus plus dot dot so on right so this way you can find out you have to memorize okay the, this one this one and this one it will be easy to you find to find the problems on expansion of e raised to power x all right and now let's see here one more result okay adding okay this and this what you will get okay right or uh, e plus e raised to power minus one if we add okay what we get let's see one upon one factorial plus one upon two factorial plus 1 upon 3 factorial dot dot and plus another one this e raised to power minus 1 1 minus 1 upon 1 factorial plus 1 upon 2 factorial minus 1 upon 3 factorial plus dot right so if we add okay we we'll get 1 plus 1 2 and these two will be cancelled and here plus 2 over 2 factorial and these to be cancelled okay again you will get here surely okay uh, 4 factorial plus and to one six factory and so on okay there is no doubt all right to get all these uh, series uh this is and the two common here one plus one upon two factorial plus one upon four factorial plus one upon six factorial and so on or you will get okay here uh e plus e raised to power minus one over two one plus one upon two factorial plus one upon four factorial plus 1 upon 6 factorial dot dot okay so this is the result okay one more result we got right so if you get okay this series you can write down 1 e plus e raised to the minus 1 over 2 no problem right so add in now let's find out one more okay result on this okay subtract e minus e raised to power minus 1 let's check what we'll get 1 plus 1 upon 1 factorial plus 1 upon 2 factorial plus 1 upon 3 factorial dot dot minus 1 minus 1 upon 1 factorial plus 1 upon 2 factorial minus 1 upon 3 factorial plus dot right now look at here we are going to subtract when you will open the bracket you will get 1 minus 1 cancel we have this becomes okay plus so 2 over 1 factorial plus and here minus this will be cancelled here okay and 2 over 3 factorial definitely okay 1 by 4 factorial and my plus 1 by 4 that, because of minus this will be cancelled out and you will get here 2 upon 5 factorial and plus dot dot right and to again common you are getting inside the bracket 1 over 1 factorial plus uh, 1 over 3 factorial plus 1 over 5 factorial dot dot right and we can write down e minus e raised to power minus 1 2 is equal 
1 over 1 factorial plus 1 upon 3 factorial plus 1 over 5 factorial plus dot dot and this one result will be dot right okay everybody so now i think okay you are clear okay you have no doubt so well let's uh, summarize all these things firstly we got okay e raised to power x now today i think you understood how to find out e raised to power x 1 plus x of 1 1 factorial plus x square over 2 factorial plus x cube of 1 3 factorial plus so on right and then we got to okay, give value of e in terms of factorial e is equal to 1 plus 1 over factorial plus 1 upon 2 factorial and plus so on right and then we got to okay, give e raised to power minus 1 okay and then we got to okay, give this one uh, e plus e raised to power minus 1 over 2 what you will get okay or sometimes if you get away okay, this series you can write down this one and uh, if you get away okay, this series in terms of factorial you may write down okay e minus e raised to power minus 1 over 2 okay so all these results okay we got today right these are very very important uh, in the topic of exponential series if you want to do the problems firstly we have to know all these results all right so in next video i will uh, bring for you uh, the problems on exponential series okay thank you very much for watching bye bye